I think it's pretty stressful. Um, just the way, when it when that like comes the days leading forward to it too. Um, just knowing that knowing that somebody might go uh, and you never know what what's going to happen. So you always in the back of your mind there's always a possibility, and then and then back of your mind you always think that it's not it's not certain. So there's obviously that um, doesn't matter how much you. You you just try to try to think not to not to think about it, um, just just keep doing your thing. But that's it's just a it's a matter of fact, and it's it's part of the part of the business. And looking at uh, these games here against Vegas, uh, they seem to be a team that's very good in transition. Uh, and I'm wondering if, if you take any kind of a different approach, knowing you know how dangerous they can be going the other way quickly. Um. Yeah, that that's definitely their. Uh, one of their strengths, they're really, really good off of that. I think they have their D-man joining, joining really aggressively. So I think just, just the reads, um, uh, what, how, do, how do we forward check uh, that stuff? Obviously, puck management is going to be big, but at the same time, when we, when we get a forward check, let's, uh, I think we gotta, gotta do a better job, just being a little more aggressive, a little more on, on our toes. I think that's when we're really good. Um, when we get pucks deep and work, uh, work their team in their end. Felt like you guys were able to kind of do that in the first half of the game. Monday, would you kind of agree with that? And were there some positive signs you can take into today? Yeah, absolutely. I, I think especially the first period. I don't, I don't even think second period was that, that terrible. It's just they make you pay. They're, they're a good team. If you make mistakes, uh, when they get their chances, they, they can score. And that's, I think that's what we've got to really focus on today. Appreciate it. Thanks, Ollie. Thanks. Next up is Jim Fox. Hey, Ollie, just to get your assessment. Um, and I'll give you my assessment and maybe get your read on it. it. It seems to me that since you've jumped back into the lineup, you're way more comfortable than you were even at the beginning of the season. Is that a safe thing, even though you missed quite a bit of time? Um, yeah, yeah, I think so. I, to be honest, I, I think the first half of the season uh, was disappointing. I, I obviously wasn't happy the way, what, way I was playing. Um, the expectation coming into the season was high. Um, I think that plays plays into it too. Um, so, so I th I think just having that time off obviously was unwanted. I definitely never want to be miss missing games. That, but it's just every day you just gotta keep working your game. You can't can't get uh, let down by that. Uh, and uh, Keep keep working as hard as you can. Keep improving, um, and just just uh, try to get back that way. Thank you. Next up is Daryl Evans. Hey, Oli. Uh, as one of the more experienced players, not only on the blue line but uh, on the entire team, when you're playing again in games like you played last game. How can you guys help the the younger players with the less experience to kind of just kind of play at an even keel and not kind of get caught up in the moments when you see games slip away? Mm. I think I think it's just whenever you you, you obviously got to talk all, all the time and just just keep talking what do we want to do um, on the bench. Then second thing is on the ice too. You can't get can't get passive. Um, you got to help each other out. It doesn't matter what you say out there. At least when you when you're talking like the other guy, who has to puck, like he know he knows where the where your teammates are, and that's a huge thing. And the second thing thing is just not be, not be afraid to make plays. I, I think we have to. Doesn't matter what the situation is, we have to make plays. But obviously, we got to be smart with it. Um, like I touched a little bit earlier, the puck management against this team is huge. We can't. I uh, can't turn it over against these guys because they're really good off the transition. They they make you pay when they get the, get the chance. They can really score. Um, but at the same time, when games are tight like that, you you got to keep chipping away uh, and uh, make those plays because you want to score the next goal too. 